or haven't had the chance to see my presentation yesterday because it will be very similar to yesterday. So welcome uh, here to presentation about uh, finishing innovations by Hunkler. My name is Hans Gut. I'm responsible for marketing and partnering at Hunkler. I will tell you a little bit about um, where we as Hunkler see the market going of digital printing and digital print finishing. Then I will tell you also a little bit about uh, new products uh, coming from Hunkler uh, this year and uh, also tell you about our new generation uh, of finishing equipment that we launched at the beginning of the year. Now, I would like to start with some information about uh, where digital print technology is moving. As you can see from that slide, there is clearly that continuous feed inkjet, the green bars here on the slide, that pages printed by ink, continuous feed inkjet technology is growing quite fast. It's growing from mainly mono toner continuous feed based uh, print technology and of course it's also growing taking away some pages from offset printed products. But here that slide just shows a little bit the decline of continuous feed ink, a toner printer and the growth of continuous feed inkjet printers. Um, I'm telling that because it's really the technology I believe that has a lot of potential, uh, has been around already for a few years, but it's definitely growing. On the next slide, I, we work uh, also a little bit uh, with uh, Drupa and they put out every about uh, nine months or so their global trends report. And, here I have a statistics basically telling the proportion of printers reporting that more than 25% of their turnover already was from digital print technology. And as you can see in that slide here, there is a, a number of different printing uh, applications do a lot of their turnover with digital print technology. Predominantly functional printers, 62%. Commercial printers, already 40%. Publishing printers, so books and so on, 22%. And I was surprised myself actually to see that already 14% uh, for package printers um, do their turn or do more than 25% turnover with uh, digital print technology. The next slide actually shows uh, the volume by print process and here you clearly see that all the top growth rates come from digital uh, technology with a plus of 25% is digital toner cut sheet color devices then 11% by digital inkjet roll, um, roll fed color devices, then 9% from digital inkjet cut sheet color, and then cut sheet toner mono actually, and then it goes into flexo and sheet fed offset um, technology. Now, I wanna go back a little bit on the inkjet technology because inkjet technology is the prominent technology where Hunkler builds pre and post finishing ex equipment for. And if we look here at the forecast from ID strategies, we had about almost 2000 digital duplex continuous feed printers installed by the end of 2017. And that number will grow quite significantly uh, until 2021. Overall, we see about 34% more new installations per year in 2021 compared to 2017 of such devices. So there is definitely some growth in some digital market 
the, or niche markets uh, like we are in. Another interesting, I think, study or forecast is then the growth of uh, inkjet cut sheet printers. There we see some significant growth, especially in the B3 format sizes. And uh, that has mainly to do with new devices that come into market or have been recently introduced because inkjet technology basically offers lower per page print cost compared to toner printers. Of course, this is a forecast and if we know one thing about forecasts, they are always wrong. Uh, some forecasts at all always tells me, well, eventually we get it right uh, with the numbers. It just will take longer to get there. But I think the trend here is also very clear. Cut sheet inkjet uh, devices will grow significantly in the next few years. A few trends we see in digital printing. Inkjet printing is growing strong. Roll inkjet printing with almost 2,000 printers installed is well established. Cut sheet ink print, inkjet printing is just starting. And then printing quality is increasing fast. Some tell me, it, depending on the application, it's already as good as toner or even as offset. Again, it's depending a little bit, of course, on the requirements that there we see also huge um, requirements differences, for example, between China, Japan, and Germany. There are huge differences about what is being considered good. But uh, I think overall everybody agrees that the improvements that have been made in, in print quality is astonishing and is going really fast. Another uh, st couple of statistics are uh, from the Drupa Global Trends. Here it shows basically what are the top print technology investments that printers plan. And as you can see in most of the segments, digital uh, devices are really on the very top of investments. That also shows really the, the trend that digital technology, print technology are really here to stay and take also the dominant uh, market share in terms of new investments. And with that, when digital printing also requires really digital finishing because I think it would be wrong to assume that just because you changed the print technology that you now gain significantly in uh, faster turnaround time, in uh, cost savings or anything like that. I think you always have to look at the entire process of producing a product end to end and finishing is a, is a very important part or important part of that because we feel already that printing itself has become a commodity and the difference is in finishing. Now, um, the last couple of uh, slides on some of the market outlook. Here are the top investment priorities based on the, global, the latest Drupa Global Trends uh, report. The big investments uh, will be made 52% in finishing, followed very closely by print technology. And as we've seen before, it's predominantly, of course, digital print technology. So, some summary on digital finishing trend. We believe at Hunker it's all about automation because with automation you really gain productivity job lengths getting shorter and shorter and in order to do those really productive we rec uh, you require our customers need automated processes automation also requires a strong workflow so having the data on the control and having the systems connected to the workflow is important and i show you later on a little bit what hunkler is doing 
about that run lengths getting shorter and shorter and we think or say start every project with finishing in mind first because or in other words look at the end product and then how do I get to the end product the most efficient way. Now a few words about Hunkler for those who do not know Hunkler yet. Hunkler is a family owned company in managing the third generation of the family and uh, has 280 employees, is located in Vicon, Switzerland, so right in the center of Switzerland. The company has been founded in 1922, so it's over 95 years old and uh, has really was almost from the beginning in the graphic arts industry, so has a lot of experience in the paper finishing industry a worldwide presence with uh, our own sales and service network around the world. We have a large install base because Hunkel was pretty much the first company that started with digital print finishing back in the 80s. And Hunkel works very close with all the different print manufacturers because we believe that it's not just about the printer and finishing, it's really about integrated solutions that have to work, work together. The main applications we serve is the publishing and commercial print market, then transactional trans promo, security printing applications and direct mail are the main segments our solutions are being sold to. Here, the portfolio, we have a number of different solutions. The Hunkler approach is a modular approach so that we can take different modules and build them into finishing lines to produce many different type of products uh, from transactional, transformer pro products with dynamic uh, coupon perforations then of course uh, different type of books and booklets to newspaper and direct mail pieces. Uh, so a, a fairly wide variety of different products that can be produced on the flexible finishing line technology from Hunkeler. As I mentioned, we have uh, roughly 8,000 solutions installed in the market from the beginning throughout the different generations of equipment that Hunkler has out there and are still in operation. A word uh, about the new native digital generation 8. It's the brand new Hunkler uh, finishing generation that has been introduced uh, or had uh, really from the beginning of this year. We already have several lines out there with customers. It is really from the ground up a brand new finishing line technology made actually for today's and the future market. When we say the future market, it's really geared toward commercial print applications, meaning processing of full color, offset coated stocks, heavier paper, uh, short run, more automation, and so on. A couple of details about the line. The generation eight is ready for the growing graphic arts segment. We're using uh, air transport technology to really hold the sheets uh, just with air, with vacuum, to so that we can guarantee no scratching, no scuffing of paper. And of course, that technology allows also to transport different type of paper with uh, minimal setup time because all these different parameters can be stored on these machines then to process different type of papers, different type of application. The Generation 8 is, is in addition and complementary to our existing product line. Generation 8 is basically 20% faster and 10% wider to give really much greater productivity overall and the all new Hunkel workflow manager for easy setup and operation really sets new standards in that 
uh, type of finishing industry uh, for uh, it's really the, the base for automation uh, to automate setup processes and so on. That's what it looks like, the workflow manager has basically a, touch, a large touch screen overview and the main areas that we cover then with the workflow manager is job definition, reporting, tracking, and then all the different service features that are available through that tool for uh, really keep the machine uh, running and have minimal or almost no downtime. Hunkler also manufactures a number of, or works with a number of different partners because we cannot do or be expert in everything. So we work very close together with Perfect Binder manufacturer, with Stitcher manufacturer, company that have hundreds of years experience in building these type of products. And uh, Hunkler is really all about integrating this technology and through the workflow manager and through software and interfaces connecting these systems for really seamless automated finishing processes. We show a few examples here. Uh, on the top left, it's an integration with sewing machines for really high-end book production. Then we have an example to integrate with Muller Martini stitchers. We have integration with different printer partners. And again, we have work very close with all the different printer partners that are out there to offer integrated uh, solutions. If you have any questions about any uh, solution that Hunkler offers, please feel free to see us over there at the little booth from Hunkler Finishing. A word about the uh, Hunkler Innovation Days. I think many of you have heard about uh, the event. Uh, it will take place from Monday, February 25 to Thursday, February 28, 2019 in Lucerne, Switzerland. Here are a few pictures. Um, we have about 90 exhibitors, so it's in a way similar to here. A little bit bigger, has 6,000 visitors we had last time in 2017. Hunkler organizes the Innovation Days every two years. And it's really an event where Hunkler organizes different partners and showcases different live application. When we say live application, it really means showing application from creation to the end when they go in an envelope, when they come out as a finished newspaper or a finished book. And you can see the process and all the different vendors and suppliers that contribute to make such applications actually work. All in a small place in one hall, uh, so you have all the subject matter expert there on site. So you are all invited. Uh, please sign up uh, at innovationdays.com. We would love to welcome you there. With that, I'm at the end of today's presentation. Thank you very much for your attention. <laughs>